game of runs, just staying patient, just um, continue to push the, push the pace, taking good shots, um, playing defense. You know, at the end of the day, it's about defense and um, execution on offense, and uh, we were very patient tonight. Fourth quarter, I think you guys shot 60% uh, in the fourth and got a lot of big buckets from a variety of guys in the stretch. What, what did you like about how you guys closed it? Patience, the communication. Um, we, we were poised. Um, you know, we kind of we had to scrap a little bit more. Um, you know, we had to really fight to get that win. But uh, once we got the lead back, we kind of you know maintained and uh, kept our composure and just kind of you know just build it on the each each possession. Nick talked about the zone and what it did for you guys and how kind of showed them bodies and broke their rhythm a little bit. Mentality-wise, what's the difference with you guys when you play that? No, just talking, communication. Um, you know, knowing where guys are going to be, knowing where um, the shooters are, um, and big, the big thing is rebounding. And um, you know, we did a good job in tonight. You know, it was a great, it was a great switch up by uh, the staff. Um, and we, we knew what they were running because you know we used to run the same play. So I kind of bump and talk and got to the right positions and you know did a good job of staying and keeping bodies in front. Did you uh, did you know you you? Your three-point shot would be there tonight. Did your legs feel good? You stepped into them. Just continue to get back in shape, man. Um, that's all you know, I know. I'll continue to say it. But as long as I just keep working and keep trying to get back in shape and keep working to get back in shape, my shot will come back. And you know, it, it's continuing to steadily come back. And I just gotta stay aggressive and keep working. This may potentially be Dirk's last season. What are your thoughts if it, um, being, playing with him for the last well, I got to, six I got to hang out with him uh, in Africa uh, a couple years ago. He's a great guy, um, one of the best competitors out there, um, uh, great humani humanitarian. Um, you know, it's about the other things that he, he didn't do for bad. He did off the court. His on the court thing speaks for itself. First battle Hall of Famer, champion, MVP, you know, all the stuff is – you know, self-said, but, you know, he's just an amazing man.